And it's already time for our final mystery. So I'm going to do a class. You know, if you tell people that you, a uh, story about what you saw, I want you to be able to say that you saw a classic of magic. Uh, so I'll do a classic of magic, and then we'll kind of wrap things up uh, with Andrea's 10. How does that sound? <laughs> Three cups, a wand, two hands. All I have to do is give a little squeeze, and I get a ball from the tip of the wand. That's for the first cup. Ball number one for cup number one. Uh, for the second, all I have to do is... A little spin, a tap, I get a second ball for a second cup. Now you can do other things. If I put a little magic into that cup, I could call solid to pass straight through solid. That's an impossible penetration. <laughs> That's ball number one for cup number one. Ball number two for cup number two. For the third, all I have to do is spin the wand once, twice, and tap. I get ball number three right where I want it. Right on top of the cup. That's one. That's two. Of course, that's three. Now, oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> At each phase, I make it easier and easier to follow, although it's already pretty simple. If you think about it, all I do is close my hand, right? I push the wand through the hand, the first ball disappears. You may not have known what to expect, so I'll do it again, exactly the same way, just a little different. Ball number three, I'll leave my hand open so that you actually see the moment that the ball disappears. And when it does, it goes back to its cup, that's one. That's two. And, and of course, that's three. Come back here. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, but I said I'd make it easier to follow. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of one of the balls. I get rid of one of the cups. I'll even get rid of the wand. So now, maybe that'll stabilize everything right there. Okay. So now, piece of cake. No question what the situation. One ball in each cup. All I do is snap, and the balls change places. It's very subtle. <laughs> Actually, it's better if I put two cups over one. That way you can tell what happens when this one joins the other one. But I'll make it even easier to follow. I'll get rid of one more ball. I'll get rid of one more cup. Now all I have to do is blow, just a blow. The ball will disappear. <laughs> The ball disappears, it comes back to its cup. I put it in my pocket, it comes back to the cup, works every time because um, it's a trick. <laughs> but I want to end with a surprise. Andrea, a golden opportunity to go double or nothing for that dollar. Um, wait, so, oh, wait a second, where's the lemon? Toss the lemon up here for me. It's a funny thing about lemons, they just last a second and they're gone. But if I put that ball in my pocket and snap, you can never tell what will turn up, get it? Turn up. Wait, it's a, it's a turnip. <laughs> a turnip turned up. There's a turnip. There's that lemon. There's that baseball. And this spuds for you. <laughs>